Reliance Industries chairman Mukesh Ambani has just announced what India had been sort of waiting to hear the welcome offer of the Reliance Geo, uh, the Reliance Geo 4G service has now been extended till the end of March uh, there is a catch the FUP or the or the fair use policy which was a 4 GB a day has now been cut to 1 GB a day so there is a catch there also the TRA had said that after December 4th you cannot extend this offer so this offer has been renamed as happy new year offer and everybody who is joining after December 4th is going to get that offer instead of the extension so one of the things that they've also seemed to have addressed is the challenge about speeds. Now, yeah. Geo is claiming that they are the fastest growing tech company, in which kind of makes sense because we have such a huge population. And it's a, when there's a free SIM involved, people were, as we saw, they were lining yeah. up. Yeah. So a lot six, of people trying to get it. Yeah. So, 6 lakh new uh, people are being onboarded every day. Uh, and thanks to the eKYC, which is a very easy process, you just put your finger onto their uh, you know, biometric device and... and and your SIM is immediately activated within uh, within five minutes, which again Ambani calls is the best SIM activation experience in the world. So let's just talk about the speeds a bit because I think yeah. that they just they said that 92% uh, of their towers are experiencing high yeah. speed, but it's only at like 8% that there's uh, congestion, yeah. and that's the reason why the FUP has been reduced from 4 GB uh, to 1 uh, GB per yeah. day. A so lot of people sadly happen to be in the in the remaining 8% because the speeds across India have fallen, fallen as yeah. more and more people have come on board the service. And that's been an issue with a lot of people. The problem there is that if you have experienced something for free and it's not really great, you might not end up paying for it. I think the biggest reason why the, uh, the welcome offer has been exp extended is that people ultimately get the experience that Reliance intends and then decide whether they want to go paid. So the other challenge I think for them is the voice calls which have been yeah, dropping yeah. because uh, they were claiming that uh, the, the other, other telecoms providers, providers are not giving them enough yeah. uh, interconnect points though yeah. that has improved. Uh, I think uh, he said in his announcement that the voice calls has, have dropped to mm. under 20% yeah. and they expect it to go further but that's still to be awaited. Yeah. Because uh, remember, uh, Reliance is calling only voice call only works on 4G VoLTE networks, yeah. and not every yeah. smartphone in India is, is yet is capable of doing it. You know, I mean, of course, it can be done by a software update, but yeah. most phones are not 4G VoLTE equipped. I think uh, the other thing was the Geo Money announcement. Mm -hmm. I think Paytm has a serious, yeah, uh, serious challenger yeah, now. So I was able to experience it real time because I I had gone to. Um, a Reliance facility uh, somewhere near Bombay and on the way there are tolls which are already accepting Geo money you know because there are a lot of people on that route who are using Geo money because a lot of employees are on the route and it, and it's a tap on the toll and you're able to pay the vision that you know Mukesh Ambani has is that you know you'll be able to pay for metro for railway for all kinds of public transport all kinds of uh, you know purchases using this thing and, and since Reliance Geo already has 52 million users and all those users are going to have access to this app and the app, app is anyway open for everybody, it's, it's going to start with a head start. Uh, it took ages for Paytm to reach 70 million. And, and the Reliance other Geo is already at 52. I think the other thing we need to remember is because eKYC is already done yeah, uh, when yeah. you sign up for Reliance Geo SIM, your limit on, number, on your limit on yeah. the uh, Geo Money app is automatically 1 lakh yeah. as a user. Mm. And that is a big advantage because yeah. it means that uh, uh, unlike uh, say a Paytm or a Mobiquick where you have to get the limit increased from 10,000 to 1 lakh yeah. by getting the EKYC done, uh, you will have to uh, on uh, Geo Money you already have, you don't have to deal with any of this. Yeah. And the app comes with the suite. So I think they have announced and quite a lot of things. I think uh, yeah. people Since will be waiting to see. the is done using Aadhaar, your financial address is already linked. Now financially who you are is the company knows and all your all the people that you're making the payment to knows so you all automatically end up uh, end up being in the digital india ecosystem so uh, one last thing do you think a lot of more people are going to be lining up now that the limit has dropped to 1 gb because remember once you cross that 1 gb limit your data daily data uh, speeds yeah. drop yeah. to 120 kbps yeah. which is not 4g yeah just nothing yeah uh, it, it, I don't think extension of the scheme is going to bring in new users. Hmm. I think it, it's going to be the same kind of transition that had. If they were getting 6 lakh users, maybe they, it'll still be around 6 lakh. I don't see a spike, but even 6 lakh users a day is, is really substantial. So by the time when they actually go, you know, um, I guess full uh, into a full service mode, they might end up with 100 million users as, uh, you know, Mr. Ambani had dreamt of.